Hi, I'm Elaine Masters. I'm a travel writer, a yoga teacher, and the award-winning author of Drive Time Yoga and Fly Time Yoga. I'm going to give you some tips to take care of your back, and you can find out more at drivetimeyoga.com. Often when we're sitting for a long period of time, if it's in the office, in the car, you might be on a long flight, all that pressure from sitting goes right down into your hips, and it can cause some pain in that area all through your back. So using pillows to relieve some of that, to help your back to relax, can make a big difference. Here's a few tips on how to help yourself with pillows so that you can use them under your knees to help your back feel less pain. The first one would be to put two pillows at least, maybe more according to how large you may be, right under your knees with laying down on your back. Because the best thing you can do for back pain is to rest and resting right down on the floor. I've laid down in airport lounges with my feet up the wall, with my knees bent, can really help to relax your back. So first of all, you would put the pillows under your knees and then just lay there and let gravity do the work for you. And also I'm gonna show you how to use a, a towel rolled under your neck. So you're using the natural curvature of your spine, just giving it a little bit more support and then relaxing, which helps your muscles just melt into the earth. And then another technique you can do is to put a pillow in between your knees when you're laying on your side. And there you want to make sure that your neck and your head is supported so there's no extra pressure there. And then having the pillow in between your legs helps to straighten out that area and the back to relax. So I have an assistant here who's going to help me show you how to do this. Susan, come on in. So here we have a towel right under her neck. You can see you can just want to roll it so it's not too big and too small. You want the natural weight of your back to, of your head to go back here. How's that feel? Mm, fantastic. <laughs> Good. And then you want to have the pillows, like I said, right under your knees. And here, the more they're raised up, the more weight can just kind of sink into your hips here. And so the sacrum just relaxes and opens up in a very natural way. Now, if you're able to get close to a wall, one great technique is to lift your legs straight up. And here again, you're letting the natural weight of your legs and your feet just kind of sink into your hips and everything just opens up and relaxes and through there. And if you can stay in this position for five or 10 minutes, it's just so, it's such great medicine for your back. It also is a great way to, to help yourself fall asleep if you're you know, a little bit nervous. And then I'm gonna show you how to do it with your knees on, the pillow between your knees. Oftentimes if you're at a hotel or if you're home you'll have a thinner pillow. You put it between your knees so that knees are supported. You want to make sure your back is not arched back but curling forward a little bit more in a fetal position and then if you lift your head making sure that your head and your shoulders are supported so there's not a lot of pressure in through this area. And that should be nice and relaxing. And again, you can do this if you're laying there watching TV. You can just do it for five or 10 minutes. It's a great way to fall asleep. Does it feel comfortable? Feels great. Okay. So I'm gonna have you go back to your back. Let's have you roll over. Again, you have the roll right under your neck. And then we're gonna do the pillows right under the knees. Here you go. So raising the knees up is the, the best way to help you relieve some of that back pain and to feel better throughout the day, help you to be more productive and relaxed when you're, you have a busy life. I'm Elaine Masters, travel writer, yoga teacher, and the author of Drive Time Yoga and Fly Time Yoga. You can find out more tips at drivetimeyoga.com, and I hope you will breathe deeply, stretch often, and travel well.